Hey, farming peeps, Tosher12 here. We're back at the Wash Ho, Wash Ho uh, farm. And we've got our new man truck. And we've done a water delivery. The restaurant needed a, a jug of water, so we took him a jug of water. And I was going to claim my uh, royalties and mineral rights. But it seems I don't get a trigger with the man tanker truck from the uh, fuel factory at all. I've even tried it with a leased version labeled fuel and no luck. And if you remember last week during that conglomeration of video and I have no I apologize I have no idea what happened to that something went stupid and I just don't know what happened anyway maybe this week will be a little better so now I must figure out how are we going to do this because I get no trigger with the man truck as I kind of hoped and figured we would it's a tanker truck I get a trigger with water I get a trigger with the herbicide I get a trigger with fertilizer and I get a trigger with fuel on the farm but we don't get a trigger here it makes no sense to me I get a trigger everywhere else and on every other map but here. So, you're going to have to figure something out. Because that's not even cool. That's just kind of crazy if you ask me. I get a trigger there. See? Boom. Get a trigger. I can fill it up. Get a trigger there. And fill it up. And. I get a trigger there and can fill it up. I have no idea what the problem is. Don't know why. I was told that's why they put the in game uh, tanker in here, or the uh, the tanker in the with the map. I've used these all over on every map, uh, and I've also used. these as well all over along with this one so I may have to try that later and see what works so until we can actually buy the tanker again it says I refuse to sell this I think it's a glitch uh, I call it a glitch anyway that's what I'm gonna call it cuz all right it should work it's a tanker truck Shouldn't matter what tanker truck you take up there to get fuel. It should work. Just my opinion. Anyway, back to it. Our uh, our, our grass field is ready uh, for cut. So let's go cut it. And while doing that, we'll put a worker on it. And I'm going to have to run back down get in my truck and we need to go over and check on our silage at the BGA because it should be almost if not already about done hopefully it's close but we don't know so but nonetheless we'll give it a look and if so we can sell that hopefully pay off our debt and if so we can take out another loan and get our tanker trailer back so we can get our royalties if you will for the fuel since we have to have a tanker which makes no sense but regardless it is what it is okay so now We'll just tab. Go to the truck. 
Oh, it's early morning still yet, too. I need some coffee. Wow. We need coffee pots on this. Seriously. That may be a, uh, uh, not a bar, but like a saloon. Old time saloon. That'd be awesome. We'll have a few drinks. See? Oh, and a look. Oop, squirrel. Our uh, soybeans are coming along nicely. It is 100% fertilized. They're still growing. And they look wonderful. Look at that. Beauty. That is nothing but beauty. Mm. And I just realized I still got to go cut that stump down over there. Oh, well, we'll get to that in a little bit. We might do that here in just a little bit. Regardless, we still need to go check on our uh, silage because it should be about done. And I better slow my cruise control down because if I don't, I'm going to be rolling, wrecking, and flipping. So you all know that. I cannot drive. Oh, look at that cotton. I so wish I owned that field because that cotton is amazing. Coming in hot. Look out. Okay. <clears throat> so, but since we sold our tanker to get the man truck, so it will be easier to transport back and forth and quicker for the transport, but now it doesn't work. So, we're just going to make do, I guess, with water transport until we can actually claim our mineral rides with whatever said truck that we can get. <laughs> Or trailer that will work. Uh, we'll probably have to take the cheaper version first, as much as I don't want to. But I guess whatever works. I would rather go big or go home. But it's whatever works, actually. All right. Let's look. We got a little cleanup right there we got to do, which I'm not fond of. Oh, look. It is ready. Oh, yeah. I thought we just had the one. Look at that. It is ready. Whoa. So, we need to go get our other tractor and trailer and bring up here to gather our silage. So, let's go do that. All right. We're back. We have got our trailer, and I went and got the tractor, and I actually stopped to get the bucket because I didn't own a bucket, <laughs> surprisingly. But look at this, and I know I'm probably way behind and everything. I've never actually used the silage bucket. It's cool when you know how to operate it. Look at that. Isn't that neater than Skater Speeder? That's just neat. And I like the fact that, look at that, boom, the front of it moves. It's neat. I like that. That is cool. So, let's get set up. We will park the trailer right here. Well, not that. The trailer. Thank you. There we go. Put that right there. Let's go uncover this. Now watch this uh, not work since I've not used it before. Boom. We'll uncover that. So now, turn our bucket on. Okay, this new having to select your equipment to use it thing kind of sucks. Let's see how this goes. Because I may or may not like this. So. Well, that fills up quick. I guess we're going to be here for a while. So. I'll get this loaded. And we will come back. So stay tuned.
Okay, we are back. I've just about got all this cleaned out. For the most part. Uh oh. Unless we have a few more incidents like that. But, and yes, I have done this all with this tractor and this uh, loader uh, and bucket. And yes, it's a slight pain when you do that right there. But, and it's painstakingly slow. But nonetheless, we got it. And we're just about done. This map, for you that don't know, is also just like the other. You wait till midnight and you get paid for your silage. I had to ask uh, my chat that to make sure. <laughs> Thanks, Moo Moo. I appreciate it. That's what I was thinking, but I wasn't 100% sure. Uh, I did go find the other sell point there at the... Uh, the animal market and for those of you that don't know it's actually behind the market i'll show you in just a second because i had to find that myself uh because it shows that you don't own this land you can't do anything but if you're selling silage you can you do not have to my goodness i did it again you do not have to own silage or own the land to sell the silage there so With that being said, I will show you all that sell point in just a second. We get all this loaded and get it dropped into the uh, sell point over there for the silage here at the BGA. And just oh, a few more buckets. I do like how this gives you on this bucket it gives you the mixture rating. Of course, I have noticed that it's not decreased or increased since I've got that first bucket of silage in it. It's remained at 100%. I don't know if it's got a glitch or <laughs> it's just that way until you mix something else in with it. So, but regardless, this is neat. I like the bucket. Uh, I may opt for a larger Ooh. bucket next time and you notice it doesn't pick up the silage so it only picks up straw the hay and silage so that's basically what it picks up so that is kind of a good thing because I didn't have to miss just trying to miss that chaff that's right there and I can use that in my next load that we're fixing to do because I'm the grass is done it is cut I've just got to go pick it up. So, that'll be coming later. Get that picked up. And get this silage done. Hopefully next time. I'm not going to make enough, of course, off of this to pay off the loan. But I can pay a substantial amount down on it. So that we can get rid of that loan fairly quick with just nothing but chaff gra or grass, chaff, and silage. So that means our crop, once we sell it, is actually operating expense for us uh, and profit because we're going to use silage to pay off our loan. Well, grass, that is. Grass, chaff, and turn it into silage. And it's free. All we have to do is just uh, cut it, collect it, and play the waiting game. Because grass is free. That's what I like about the grass chaff. Because it's free. It's not like corn. You don't have to plant and replant and plant and replant and harvest and plant. And You plant it and harvest it and harvest it and harvest it and harvest it. And that's all you do. It's grass. It's free. Because it regrows. So that's what we plan on doing. We're going to leave field 10 as grass because it's a decent sized field. Now we may expand upon that with other fields, but as of right now, we're just going to leave field 10 as the grass and just use it as we see fit as far as silage or hay or whatever the case may be. Now when we get uh, cheap, we'll have to use some of that grass for feed. But right now, we're just going to use it for chaff. And turn that chaff 
into silage. Oh, look, we didn't get all of it. Dad gum it. We got like a little half a bucket left. But we'll get it. And we'll drop it over there behind us. And then it's a waiting game. So we get this knocked out. I will show you the cell point over at the animal market. And that will probably conclude today because uh, I've got to pick up some grass and bring it up here and turn it into some chaff and blanket it for some more silage for the next round. I could actually go into uh, logging because logging is actually profitable uh, on this map. But I think I'll wait and do that because me and logging doesn't get along generally when I don't have the scorpion. <laughs> I would so much rather have the scorpion. It's so much easier. And doing it by chainsaw just really sucks. So we've got all that picked up. I do not know how many leaders we had. I really have no clue. Uh, I don't remember from uh, when I put it in here as to how many it was. But at midnight, it will tell us the final of what we made, and we'll get a deposit, so that'll be awesome. Can't wait for that. Looks like I have a little bit laying right there on the ground. Oh, well. Maybe not. Anyway, now we've got this, and on my way back, while I show you the sell point for the animal market, go wash the tractor and trailer, keep it clean, because I like keeping them clean, because for one, just... I just don't like them dirty. And another, it cuts down your maintenance. So, let's go find the sale point and wash some equipment. I do have to say, I still like this. And boy, when it gets dark on this map, it gets dark. I can't see anything. I literally was going uh, to get water at the uh, little spring. And I ended up over on field 17. Yes, I ended up over on field 17. And I was totally away from the water. I couldn't see when it gets dark and I had headlights on. Now I was in the man truck, so the tanker truck. So it, you know, of course, it's not all that bright. But I couldn't see, I mean, at all. In cab, out of cab, first person, third person, it didn't matter. I could not see. That's the only thing, one of the only things I dislike about this map is at night, you, the, the lights aren't bright enough. You can't see crap. Now, when the UFO comes over, it does kind of help, but it doesn't stay long. And I usually fall asleep, or I yeah, don't fall asleep. I just end up on the couch waking up, not knowing what happened. But still, when it gets dark on this map, it gets dark. The uh, other thing is the roads are really hard to see because they blend in. Uh, I plan on changing that when I make it big time because uh, when I get big time on this and uh, I've got uh, more money in Quakers got oats, I will paint the roads. But until then, I am just going to have to live with it. <laughs> here is the sell points here at the animal market. Now here at the very end right here, that is your chaff, or your chaff. This is your silage sale point right here. You do not have to own this to dump the silage. It looks like chaff and uh, manure, maybe? Grass, chaff, manure, something like that. There's the bales. There's the hay. Straw. Grass. So it's all right here. So don't get confused and try to go to the front and it says you don't own this because right here is where it's at. I've done that. <laughs> it don't work all that well. So circle around out of here and go wash this thing. I appreciate everyone watching. Thank you. A thumbs up would be great. Uh, if you have any ideas of things I need to do or improvement, let me know. Comment down below. I'd appreciate it. Uh, 
and little tidbits about the map that I probably more than likely don't know would be greatly appreciated. Uh, I am going the wrong way right now. Hmm. Figures. I think I am anyway. I will. We'll get there. So, maybe a map for the map. That would help. But I appreciate it. Thanks, everyone, for watching. Uh, I'll probably trade that little bucket because I just, I don't know. It's okay. It's cool. But I don't like having to work that hard to scoop it up. And on the end game, I plan on getting a conveyor and putting in there and just moving it around. Hopefully. So, but thank you for stopping by. Comments are always welcome. Thumbs up, please. And until next time, we'll catch you later. Now let's watch this thing.